Hello everyone, happy Tuesday. Here I am with Tanya and Caroline, and we and they are going, they're part of our landings group, and they're going to talk to us today about uh, chapter 15 of our wonderful book on kindness called Cultivate a Love That Overflows in Kind Deeds. So ladies, take it from here. Thank you, Father Michael. We're delighted to be here. Let me first just explain a little bit about the OLA Landings Group. Landings is a faith building uh, group or organization that consists of people who maybe felt a little disconnected from their Catholic faith or even left the Catholic faith for a period of time. And we have come together to help and support each other growing in our faith. And so one of the things that we've done is we've read this book together as a team. And I really highly recommend reading it uh, as a team. It has been very compelling and we've really gotten a lot out of it. We've been really pleased that we were given the opportunity to talk about chapter 15, cultivating a love that overflows with kind deeds. And what we did is we uh, took examples from the book, from some examples Father Michael has given us, especially during Lent. And then as a team, we brainstormed some ideas of kind deeds that we thought we would share with the OLA community. So Carolyn is here, and she's going to share our list with you. Hi, everyone. Uh, it's a pleasure to be here also. Uh, so chapter 15, the overall uh, subject was how one can transfer kind thoughts into kind deeds. And as Tanya mentioned, our group got together and brainstormed, okay, how can we really make this happen? And so we came up with some, we thought, pretty good examples of kind actions that meet the criteria of this book. Uh, so a few examples that we came up with was first, use kind words in your day-to-day -day life. And so some examples of that is um, when you see your mailman, when you go to the grocery store, remind them how valuable they are as essential workers. And any other people in your day-to-day -day life that this would work for. The second example we came up with was go out of your way to be kind to people that may be overlooked. And we thought of the disabled or maybe the homeless and it doesn't have to be a big thing it could be a smile it could be a hi how are you this may make their day it may be the only nice thing that has been said to them all day so we thought that was really valuable a third example we thought of was sending out cards written cards or making calls to people that you don't usually talk to uh, one of our members suggested get out your Christmas list and pick some names out of that Christmas list that you send once a year, oh, but maybe you could send them a card in between. Uh, we just felt that, I, I don't know if I can remember the last time, I have one friend who sends me cards all the time. She loves writing things and hates text and hates email. She does, she does those, but she also sends me the written word, and it's so special to me, because when I would see, see uh, you know, an envelope with her name on it, I thought, oh, I've gotten a written missive. Uh, so those are a few examples of what we came up with. Um, and we hope that, uh, the landings groups hope that this helps you on your journey for kind actions. And just if, uh, for a, a little promotion for landings, um, it's been really helpful to me. I was, became returned to the church been about two years ago and it's really trans personally transformed my life. I was out of touch for quite many, many years and I actually got an email about this and I still know, don't know who sent me this email, um, but it transformed my life. So if you have friends or if you know somebody that, oh, I don't go to church anymore or I, I need, I'm missing something in my life, I need some spirituality, Tell them about landings. It's a fabulous group. Uh, it works for most. We have 
there are people who don't stay the course and it, it's just very non-threatening um, and I encourage you. So thank you very much. Yeah, and if you are interested in landings, just let the rectory know. They know how to get in touch with us and we or whomever you recommend, we'd love to hear from you. Well, thank you ladies, that was absolutely wonderful. And here of course, I'm next to the, the miniature, uh, our church here in miniature. But we're being in love and in kindness. And so, what I want you to, uh, two other little points, I know we're going on long today, just to say, don't forget uh, to be part of the Mother's Club um, promotion on, online for the auction. It helps the parish and helps the school. And, and that's going on this week. The details uh, you'll find Click below here on your email today. And also remember the dinner, the men's club dinner, the prime rib uh, on Thursday night. And so you're still in time to order. Do it today. Thank you. Have a great few days. Bye-bye.